Many people may think, you know, that the philosophy is uh, interesting, asks important questions, uh, but it's too difficult to read. It's, it's too boring to read, you know. Uh, it's very academic, you know, uh, the language of philosophy, so to say. So I felt, you know, when I wrote my book, uh, Sophie's World, you know, mm -hmm. then I, I tried to write an easy, accessible introduction to the history of philosophy, also as a story, so that it could be had it kind of this entertainment aspects as well, you know. Uh, and I think that is part of the reason why the book was spread so much around the world. I do think that a, a real clear and important thought it is always possible to communicate in a comprehensible, easy way, you know. So often when philosophers, uh, traditional philosophy has uh, had a very uh, yeah, kind of a dif difficult language, uh, it is uh, because they haven't worked sufficiently on trying to communicate it in an comprehensible way. I think that uh, we are born curious, you know. So in a way, uh, many uh, young children are philosophers because they are giving, uh, uh, asking questions, you know. Uh, a lot of important questions in history uh, are asked by children. Like, for instance, the fairy tale when the, you have a naked uh, emperor and no adult dared to, to point at the emperor and say that he was naked. But a child did. Why is the emperor naked? I, I met uh, uh, an American woman and she saw, uh, she had a daughter, six years old, and she saw uh, an in I know, a speech made by <coughs> George Bush Sr., you know? Mm -hmm. And uh, after finishing this speech, the girl asked her mother, w b because the president said, God bless America. And then the girl just turned to her mother and said, but wh why, does, why does the president say God bless America? Why doesn't he say God bless the world? Be be because you know, according to Christian theology, uh, God is God not only for America. A and you have a lot of examples. But as you mentioned, you know, often uh, 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 people, uh, young people, children are stopped in their question making. The best thing we can do not only to have a conscious and wandering uh, young generation, but also a critical one. And that is important for any democracy. democracy. So I, think the, it's, it's imp I don't think it's very important to have philosophy as a subject in school for, for young children, because they are, they are so curious already. But, but the, the teacher should uh, estimate uh, them to really ask questions, you know? And I think it's done too little. And I think that the te often teachers are afraid of letting kind of the, the voice, you know, of, of the pupils to be, be, be raised.